Jamie Conlon 19,110 turns, 31 today, but the Belfast super flyweight won't be acknowledging that fact. The Mexican is fully focused on his upcoming world title fight on Saturday, November 18, when he takes on IBF champ Jerwin Ancajas at the SSC Odyssey Arena in Belfast. Everything is pointed toward that night in just over five weeks' time and Conlon is keen to remove all distractions ahead of the big bout. Since HBO brought Roman Gonzalez onto their channel two years ago, the super flyweight class is increasingly becoming one of boxing's glamour divisions. Always a hotbed of talent, the scarcity of English-speaking fighters led to the 115-pounds division being somewhat overlooked by Western fans. This is all changing however, and last month HBO ran Superfly, a bumper card featuring two super flyweight world title fights and one eliminator. Superfly 2 is already in the pipeline, and all the current champions are in the reckoning for big fights, but Conlon does not want to get ahead of himself. While a win next month could be a ticket to the big-time stateside, Conlon HASNT even considered this possibility. I don't even think about what happens after this fight, stressed Conlon. I am focused on this fight and it's such a dream to have it in your home city. To win a world title against one of the best fighters in the world and to do it in a cauldron atmosphere that the SSE Arena brings and do it in front of people I went to school with or trained with over the years is brilliant. While the atmosphere will be intimidating, Conlon does not plan on turning heel for the fight. One of the nice guys of boxing, the Mexican won't be engaging in press conference pats or weigh-in shoves. There is no need for that, said the St. John Bosco graduate. At the end of the day I won't change who I am to suit someone else. I am who I am and I am comfortable with who I am. I will never be someone who I am not. What's in the ring is all that matters. It's a massive step up in class for Conlon, but the focused fighter is ready to take his opportunity. The world title fight is a leap in levels, and comes to Conlon without a fringe world level fight so to speak. This does not worry the Irishman though, and he plans for November 18th to be the culmination of a lifetime's work. I have taken a lot of punishment in some fights, so why not just get in for the big one now reasoned Conlon. I have had 200 plus amateur fights. I have fought every style imaginable as an amateur and a pro. Photo credit Ricardo Guglielmino D, the fighting Irish at the Fearish related.